This is Susan Bush for SGTV. Floribundance marks the arrival of spring at Sullivan Goss and American Gallery, and we are fortunate enough to have three talented artists to help usher in the season. Jane Willis Taylor packs a bright punch with her paintings. Flowers seem to float in their own space, not rooted to the earth or overshadowed by any other objects that might distract from the flower itself. They are powerful mandalas of color and life. Confetti Dahlia invites the eye to wander, petal by petal, as if through a maze of contemplation that quiets the mind while inspiring it at the same time. Jane paints with a modern sensibility for a centuries-old subject matter. Flowers have been reproduced by artists in all forms, from precise botanical drawings to vases of impressionist bouquets. Often chosen for their accessibility and abundance, they are quintessentially objects of natural beauty that capture light and color indoors and out. It's no wonder they are often an artist's go-to subject. Eric Wirt paints with the precision and realism reminiscent of the 17th century Dutch masters, using elaborate textiles and detailed interiors in his compositions. His flowers are grounded in the world by the objects around them and the evidence of surrounding nature. Eric's often surprising compositions add a contemporary twist to the beloved genre of the still life. John Nava takes us straight to the source of life for these flowers. Wide open fields, sun, wind, clouds that bring rain, a source of life for plants and humans alike. His classic painting technique brings an artistic gravitas and an elevation of importance to a simple yet widely revered subject matter flowers in abundance. Make fine art a part of your life. Floribundance will be on display from May 5th through July 31st, 2011.